Until June 30th, Bell has unlimited data plans. There's four, there's three of them. Unlimited 10, which is $75, more or less. And uh, then they have unlimited 20, which is basically 10 gigs, 20 gigs and 50 gigs respectively. And look at the prices. They are not affordable, but they are for those that can afford them, that have big budgets and all that crap. And you know how long it took for them to actually offer that? Telus hasn't yet. This is a premium. Same amounts. Same amounts. Same amounts. These are basically for uh, the tabs. But yeah. It took them 35 years to actually cough up unlimited plans. Now, let's go to Rogers. Same thing. They branded it as Rogers Infinity. But this one is more or less. Uh, you can't find these here. You they're only on smartphone plans, but then unlimited. The shows learn more, blah, 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 blah. So like, choose your plan type, no tab. The shows basically the same thing what it is. See? Same things. And they slow you down to 256K. Same 20, 10, and 50. And, uh, that's. That's their plans. That's their unlimited plans. But these ones are more or less, it doesn't say when the plan will end. And, uh, that's funny, you know? It doesn't tell you when the plans will end, but I'm going to assume it's probably, uh, let's just see the full details. Hmm. It does not say anywhere about them ending after June 30th. Which is funny. No, nope, does not say that. Okay. So there you go. So Rogers is basically permanently put up unlimited data on on uh, three of their plans that cost an arm and a leg, seventy five a month. If you can afford it, that's ten gigabytes. My plan with Freedom Mobile is actually thirty five a month for the same thing. And it includes use in the United States for free. Yes, for free. Unlike you got a pay per day on Rome Like Home on Rogers and Rome Better on Bell. Mine's included. And I have all of this. Plus more. I don't need an application, which is stupid. It's pretty much the same thing, except mine's kind of the US wide. My message is world, not limited to Canada. So that's the only difference. And yeah. How long does it take them to uh, put these plans in? 35 years to eventually offer unlimited data. They could have done it 20 years ago. They could have easily done it. And oh, then again, they're going to bitch about congestion. Yeah, Rogers Bell and Telus are going to bitch about Congestion, yes, congestion. They're gonna bitch about it, but however, let them. They're probably gonna end up slow. It's gonna be uh, it's gonna be really, really, really congested and slow, more or less. They hoarded enough spectrum to actually do this. This is funny. This is funny. Bell's only doing it until again, June thirtieth. And then it's done. Well, that's all I gotta say. You know something? I will always stick to freedommobile.ca. I will always stick with them. You know what? Things are a lot more fair. And their plans are literally better. They have LTE also. Let's look at their plans. It's pretty much, it costs far less. Let's look at them. See? They are cheaper. And the prices are far lower, depending. The big gig ones cover Canada, literally. The smaller ones are cheap. They are affordable. And data is unlimited. 
That's what I like about their plans. My plan is hidden. Because it's old. It's not shown. But it's cheap. And I'm happy. That's all I gotta say. I'm sticking with Freedom Mobile. No, I'm not paid to do this video. I'm not paid to do anything when talking about my favorite carrier. Cheers. You don't like this video? This is all you gotta do. Oh, F4. Cheers. Thanks for watching.